All right, this is a video walkthrough of the STC GX45 NGW. <laughs> All right, and so we've got our SIM card in here. It's a data-only uh, SIM card for uh, tablets and gaming devices. Now, if you turn this over to test, you're going to see IMEI number needs to go to uh, whichever you use, uh, AT&T, T-Mobile, whatever system uh, you're able to go to, and you're going to need to uh, give them that information. Next, you press Menu, go down to Cellular Settings, go to your account, and make sure that you enter in your uh, email exactly as it appears. Uh, and the uh, uh, password is going to be case sensitive. Make sure that's fully entered in. And then press OK. Come back here. And then you're going to go to cellular modem. Make sure it's press enter for on. Transmit. Press enter. Make sure you press enter for on. Upload resolution. Mm, high or low, whichever you decide. Upload frequency. Up to you. Go through all these and press enter through all of them. Show you decide. So all options that you have the availability to do. This is updating the location just takes a second here. Right now it's just connecting. See, that didn't take too long. We gotta go back to cellular settings though, because that took a little while. Okay. APN name. If you're having uh, AT&T, it most likely will be broadband with a capital B. It's okay. APN account should be blank the username and the password. Signal strength. I'm going to skip that one for now. Upload time. You want to set this for the nearest half hour to now. Press OK. Date and time sync. Do auto or manual, whichever you wish. You're going to do signal strength. I'm going to do this about, uh, let's go to connect to tower. Do this about three times. Just make sure it's connecting. Let's click uh, OK. And then you're going to uh, do this a couple times. I do about three times. <clears throat> And press OK. One more time. Thank you for calling GSM Customer Service. Number. And, uh, Can I get your first and last name, please? Now, once this is done, we're actually going to press Menu again. I'm actually going to All right. and how can I go up to the cellular wizard. Press OK. Hit reset. Set your language. Okay. Okay, and I'm actually just gonna. How is it going? Okay. So which model camera is it that you have? So, uh, you can go ahead and. Time zone is mountain. Yep, that's correct. Yeah, that's not normally something we do, but um, we set up network. This may take a few, several minutes. I'm just trying to block the uh, information okay. on here. So uh, that camera will work uh, all the time, day and night. Um, it'll take 
black and white pictures at night and then network fan i can't set up okay um and i'd be happy to walk through the setup with you if you wanted all right that is correct Uh -huh. password you, you would need some AA batteries Enter. and an SD card um, anywhere from 2 okay. to 32 gigabytes and you just want to stay away from <clears throat> anything that says uh, micro or mini or adapter on it okay All right, our setup is complete. Now, if I were to go to menu, go to sync settings, and this will now have appeared. Originally, uh, it was here, but if you haven't done this before, that would not be there. So you press enter, get updates. Yes, for sure. And now you should be synced up to your tablet, which you'll also need to down, uh, download the app for. Um, uh, originally, you're going to have to set up your account uh, on yeah, there and an uh, make sure that um, uh, you, uh, with the registration email, confirm that. And you should be set up to start taking some pictures. Right, this is uh, the end of this tutorial right. from GSM Outdoors. They'll be black and white.